Henry flanking Blake Sims. They're going to fly sweep it though to Amari Cooper. Just one of the many ways they get it in his hands and a nice run up as a wide receiver and Sims on a second down at five from the 30. Gives it off to Henry. Only got about a yard though. And it'll bring up third down and three. P.J. Yeldon is in the Alabama backfield, but it sims a throw to Cooper. Got his left hand and has had a great bowl preparation, but the absence of Yeldon, a big factor for Alabama. He was in for that one play on third down, but never touched the ball. And Sims fires far side, complete, even though there's two guys. When both of them are healthy. And here is Derrick Henry, tripped up and dropped. Yeldon in there with Sims. Heavy pressure up the middle, passes well. Thanksgiving. Let's see if the Tide can capitalize. And it's Sims with a run straight up the middle. Blake Sims ran for about 300 yards this season. That's two. You have to prepare for that. You have to defend it. And now it's big Derrick Henry rumbling down the sideline. Touchdown. NFL draft choice looks like. Look at him. Here's Derrick Henry on the pitch. Broke one tackle and out of bounds. He's got it all the way out of the 47 yard line. Henry, big hole on the left side, cuts it back to the 40. Now Steve Miller had to take over that spot from another one of the guys that would have been a big time defensive lineman, Noah Spence, who was suspended. Incomplete pass here. Yeldon. T.J.'s got the first down at the 35. And caught the Ohio State defense a little out of position. And T.J. Yeldon easily can Cooper time right here. Henry, boy, planted his foot. And the ability of the quarterback to read that and keep it off that same action if they overplay it to the outside. Henry straight up the middle, diving for what appears to be the... Sims up to the line and now backs out. Amari Cooper's in the backfield with him on first down. Sims heavy pressure. Throws far side, complete. And it's foul of the fullback. Very close. They fake the pitch to him. Sims on a bootleg. Throws on the run. Touchdown, Amari Cooper. Behind Sims. Amari Cooper in motion. They're going to throw it to him. And a shoestring catch at the 40. Size and strength. Now Cooper's in the slot. They're going to throw it to him again out there, looking for a blocker. Puts his hand down and he's dropped. Right there. Third down and three. TJ Yeldon back in there. He'll get the carry. And he's not going to get the first down. Two tight ends. Power set. Sims flushed out of the pocket throws to the sideline and completed it down in their own territory already cost them seven points could happen that they're going to add to it here is Alabama on second and six just a little lob out to Vogler he had to catch it twice he's going to be get a quick one here they're up to the line in a hurry and it's Yeldon and I don't think he got there nice play Yeldon's a tailback He'll get the call and the first down. First and goal. Alabama. Hitting up into the line of scrimmage. See no white shirts across that line of scrimmage. And an easy leverage. The low man wins. That time Alabama was the winner. First and goal just outside the one. It's Yeldon again and he'll walk in. Touchdown Alabama. Amir Abdul. Amir Abdullah in Nebraska and, and Jeremy Langford who had a huge game for Michigan State today. So. So many great backs in the Big Ten. Sometimes you get lost in the shuffle a little bit. Amari Cooper broke one tackle and then knocked up on his turn with a second down and four. Derrick Henry with Blake Sims in the tie backfield. They fake it to him and throw out to DeAndre White, who's dropped after maybe a eight passes. Well, here's Cooper right here. They've got him kind of protected. It will be a pass. It will not be complete. Here's an eye backfield for one of the first times tonight with Johnston Fowler, the fullback. They fake it to Yeldon and Sims in trouble. Scrambles out of trouble, first down and a bunch more. And the ball came out of the end, but I think. Game. Ohio State just barely got set defensively. Alabama's ready to go, and Yeldon takes it around the corner. Wanted to do it. Lane Kiffin 
decided to do it, and it's paid dividends. Sims is leveled. Alabama wanted to do to start the third quarter was give up a touchdown to the Buckeyes and then have a situation like this, third down and eight. Sims flustered again, down again. This time it's... Good pressure by Michael Bennett. Spin move on the guard, Leon Brown. That's just great individual effort by an interior lineman rushing the... D.J. Yeldon is behind Blake Sims. They'll hand it to him, and he's cut down. After Sims about three yards deep in his own end zone to take the snap, and they're going to keep it on the ground, and Yeldon broke it out there for what looks mobile. That's Derrick Henry back in at the tailback spot, and he'll get the toss with Fowler in front of him. Derrick Henry down the sideline. Big run by the 33-yard line. That's Fowler in motion again. They fake the toss and a throwback to Fowler. Head-on collision there. And Fowler now comes out as a wide receiver to the bottom of your screen. They'll give it to Henry, and he's going to lose a yard, maybe two. Switch places. Sims, quick throw, intercepted. Picked off by Steve Miller. Miller. Defensive lineman dream. T.J. Yeldon trying to cut back, looking for a block from his quarterback. And a stiff arm as he goes out. At the of him this year, one of the reasons why his team re rallied around him so much, his resiliency. And this team trying to get back in the ballgame. Voted the most inspirational player on the team for Alabama. He's inspiring things right now. Yeldon. First and goal for the Tide at the five. Sims play fake, lobs it for Vogler, and he couldn't handle it. I'd be surprised to see a quarterback run design here. Fowler, the fullback, is going to lead the way for exactly what Todd called. Touchdown! Similar situation here tonight. Derrick Henry, straight up the gut for about seven. Good when he's been in the game. Second and three, Henry again, diving, and somebody's helmet came yeah, off in the Michael middle. Bennett. It's Michael Bennett. Sims under center, blitz coming, he fakes it to Henry and rifles it far side, and it's incomplete. And lines up on the left side, we haven't seen anything from him tonight. And now Amari Cooper in motion. Sims rolls right, fires, intercepted by Von Bell. At the 45-yard line. The Andrew White in motion. Fake the stretch play, and Sims wants to throw, and now he's going to run with it. Gets what he can and gets out of bounds. Derrick Henry. Got a first down. Reception at the one-yard line. Derrick Henry now closing in on that 100-yard mark as well. Ezekiel Elliott all well over that for Ohio State. Here's Henry and a nice cutback. Got close to the 41. Straight drop by Sims on second and seven. Pressure coming from Bosa. He runs away from him, but only got to the 40-yard line. And right now he's got an All-State Sugar Bowl rushing record. Here's a throwback and over the head of O.J. Howard. Used one of their timeouts earlier. They only got two. And we've only got 3.12 left in the fourth quarter. They need some big plays. Sims trying to get them one. Going long. Got White out there. DeAndre White to the 15-yard line. Pass play down to the 14-yard line. Sims again. Trying to throw a middle screen. And that one ran into some. And Cardell Jones, who's been... Very good tonight. Sims. And he throws this one away. Amari Cooper was the closest. What Blake Sims cannot do here is take a sack. Throws complete to Howard, the tight end. That's his first catch. Valuable time ticking off that clock. I don't know why you didn't have two plays called there at the line of scrimmage. This time they go to Black, and he got leveled, and the ball and is out. Comes out to the bottom of your screen. 15 seconds to play. No timeouts for Alabama. Trailing by a touchdown. Pressure coming. He's going to air it out long. Floats in the air 
in. Almost caught by the 15 catches. Should get the ball targeted to him here. Maybe the last play. Sims. Deep. Hail Mary. Not answered. Intercepted. Ohio State's going to win it.